Hi guys. Hope uh, all is well. Today we are going to learn how to create a stock item and uh, accounts. The process of accounts payable. Accounts payable in simple terms, uh, you can say purchase cycle also, from purchase order to uh, goods receipt note and uh, purchase bill and payment, making the payment to supplier. We'll learn all these things today. Today, before going to this, uh, in last class uh, we had a small problem that uh, differences in opening balance. Uh, we will clear that today and I uh, will go to the topic. Uh, let's go to balance sheet. I will go to detailed. And detailed uh, will match with last year balance sheet we have owners capital it is the problem in the liability side so it is taking 10,000 year and matching the uh, both the side so we have to check in the liability side so owners capital relax is there and a loan from SBA 2070 is there and uh, security accounts payable under accounts payable we have three party abc company under accounts payable will go to accounts payable accounts payable is nothing but uh, current liability it will go under current liability so we can enter on that uh, you have uh, Hundred creditors and that you will get all the parties. So here it is accounts payable. We'll get all the parties here. So ABC company 10, 20, 30, 10 ABC King Faisal establishment 20 and with Milton 30. That's fine. So escape from here. Next is uh, advance from customer. Advance from customer is 15. Thousand okay, and anything is missing. Yes, IT payable. IT payable is missing. Okay, so we will check whether uh, the ledger is created. We will go to account info, ledgers, alter IT payable. Yeah, it is there, but the opening balance is missing. What is the amount? The same difference 10,000. So we fix the problem. Uh, if, if you have huge data, uh, this is a big problem to find uh, where is the opening uh, balance, difference in opening balance. It is a, uh, it is one of the big problem. Okay, so we'll, uh, <coughs> I will teach you in the uh, future classes how to clear the uh, differences in opening balance if you have huge data. Okay, now we'll go to the topic. First, we have to create the uh, before going to the topic i will explain you uh, how it will work <coughs> accounts payable process or in simple terms it is purchase cycle okay uh, first uh, we'll issue the <coughs> po and uh, we'll receive the goods then we'll inspect the goods then that is uh, we'll check the goods whether uh, the same ordered goods have been received or not uh, once it is confirmed uh, we'll uh, uh, match the PO and receipt note whether it is uh, what is the order and uh, what is receipt uh, is uh, whether it is matching or not we'll check it and uh, if once it is uh, matching we'll make the uh, invoice means uh, we'll enter the purchase okay in our book after that uh, uh, according to the payment terms we'll uh, make the payment okay so we'll start first uh, what we'll do we have to create stock items how to create stock items in the gateway of tally you have to go to inventory info stock items create okay uh, you in the name you have to type the name stock item stock item let it be stock item no problem okay name of the item is stock item well, uh, it, it may be anything it is uh, uh, dip, it depends on your uh, business uh, which uh, goods you are dealing with okay uh, it may be anything 
uh, if you are dealing with uh, electronic goods uh, this uh, tv and mobile anything it may be you have to take the same stock item so you have to enter the same stock item name here okay if you have a variety of uh, groups you have to uh, create groups also we'll uh, learn later okay units <clears throat> units what we will take will take units pieces yeah uh, if uh, units are not there you have to create units okay if uh, you, units are not existing here you have to create to create that from this field just you press alt c okay pieces are there uh, if you want to create numbers for example in uh, number minimum number is one uh, whether it is mobile or tv or uh, anything it is uh, so okay, minimum number will be one lesser than that uh, i don't think so it will be in kgs you may have but in numbers and pieces minimum number will be one so number of decimal places i don't want so it is zero so i take number uh, number pieces anything you can create okay so alternate unit uh, as of now it is not required not applicable so I'll enter, 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 enter. No opening balance. No. Enter. So we have created stock item. One item is enough for now. You know the path, right? From the gateway of tally, inventory info, stock item, create. Okay. To check whether it is created or not, instead of going to create, you have to go to display. Stock item is there. Stock item one and stock item. Both the items are there so i'll go to the transaction what we have to do and one one seventeen issue po for 10 pieces of stock item stock item this is the stock item name okay stock 10 pieces of stock item to abc vendor supplier okay to the purchase order now to the ABC company for 10 pieces of stock item for that what we you have to do you have to go to order vouchers order normally order vouchers uh, you cannot see this option uh, if you if you are uh, not able to see this option what you have to do you have to go to F11 and uh, entry features entry features under order processing you will get purchase order to enable purchase order processing uh, with this uh, you have to enable one more option to uh, track perfectly from uh, purchase order to payment uh, to track perfectly you have to not to up to payment uh, up to uh, purchase entry uh, you have to track properly otherwise uh, you may uh, miss something whether uh, ordered uh, for some quantity received some quantity there may be mismatching so you have to enable one more option that is tracking number use tracking number you will get under other features so accept enter enter accept escape so after enabling that you will get this option order vouchers first you have to do what you have to do issue the order on one 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 okay so we'll make it uh, one four instead of one 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 four two four and uh, same two four mm, because uh, why i'm doing this is uh, the company is starting from 1417 okay so we cannot uh, make the transaction below that date so i'm changing this date we'll make this to 31st 5 okay i think as uh, two months uh, credit period we have so first one is 114 issue the purchase order so 14 date is there okay from who to whom you have to issue the purchase order abc company so abc company you have address if you have typed uh, while creating ledger as i said uh, in the last class it will automatically fetch here so i don't want to enter anything here more of uh, terms of payment of six days credit period credit period okay so terms of delivery okay enter 
order number is 001 I say okay this is very important to track the entire purchase cycle okay purchase order uh, purchase order number it is order number here you have to select purchase ledger okay you know how to create ledger and uh, after entering from here you will not see the screen if you cannot see the screen you have to just press space bar space bar uh, in the keyboard okay just select the stock item for what item you have to issue the order stock item okay we have stock item and stock item one so we need stock item not stock item one so i'm selecting this this is the quantity here it is 10 pieces this is the number I think. 10 numbers at uh, let us think at the rate of 1000 okay so enter 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 that's it let us purchase order is issued okay and uh, next one is receive goods on uh, 2nd april you have you will receive the goods okay uh, it is uh, inventory vouchers uh, you have to go from no uh, let us go from uh, direct okay that is uh, in the gateway after you have to go to inventory vouchers okay inventory vouchers you have to go to receipt note and the uh, receipt note if you enter you will see this screen <coughs> reference number if you want you can uh, enter reference number okay if you have any reference you can enter uh, what is the date 24 right so i am changing the date 24 so same company abc so here you have order number okay order number if you have multiple order numbers all will list out here so you have to select the required uh, order number enter enter enter, enter. So everything will auto filled. What is the quantity you have raised here? You, uh, you will not miss anything because of the tracking number. Everything will be proper. Okay. So once it is uh, confirmed, I uh, mean uh, after uh, receiving the goods, you have to inspect the goods whether ten is there, uh, whether the ordered quantity is there or not. If it is there, you have to just keep on entering. Okay. And, you have received the goods then on the same date you have entered the uh, purchase bill also okay uh, you have to go to, for that you have to go to uh, in the gateway of tally you have to go to accounting vouchers accounting vouchers in the accounting vouchers uh, purchase you have here f9 uh, or alternative way you can use uh, f9 uh, in the keyboard or you can click here purchase okay in the purchase here supplier invoice number the supplier invoice number will be having uh, on uh, on the invoice uh, raised by supplier okay uh, from that uh, you will get this you enter this uh, supplier invoice number I click uh, one two three the date is same so party abc and uh, here you have the stuff tracking number same zero zero one you have so just keep on entering everything will get auto filled okay there is no mismatch because of the tracking number will get there will be no mismatch just enter 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 here one thing you have to uh, be very careful you have to select new reference here okay uh, no not against or on account advance you should not take anything you have to take new reference okay i will tell you why it is just uh, enter enter this enter 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 okay now after uh, purchase what is next you have to make the payment on 31st 5 for payment from the gateway of tally accounting vouchers accounting vouchers payment you have to you can uh, use the f5 or uh, you can uh, click here payment uh, for example uh, i am uh, paying through my icic bank so 
selecting in the account ICICI Bank. Uh, here uh, you are not getting anything. So what you have to do? Press space bar. Space bar. To whom you are making the payment? ABC Company. ABC Company have twenty thousand, but uh, the last purchase what you have made? For 10,000 and against that we are making the payment for example I will make the payment of uh, 9,000 let it be 1,000 balance okay against reference here you have to select against reference here you have to select against reference so select it in case uh, if uh, if you are making the payment advance you can take advance also here you are making the payment against the invoice so against reference you have to take against which here uh, in the last class, I told you uh, the reference you have to enter. See here, bill number 123, I had entered in the last class. In the opening balance, it is showing here. You are making the payment against uh, opening balance or this. If not at, uh, as of now, we are making the payment against uh, bill number 123. Okay. So, I am uh, entering. Just automatically, it will take 9,000. So enter, <coughs> enter, 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 enter. If you are, uh, if you want to write uh, some narration, you can write uh, the partial payment made. Made. Okay. So enter. Accept. Okay. Now uh, everything is completed. Uh, we have issued the his order and uh, we have received the goods and uh, we have enter uh, invoice into the purchase uh, invoice okay and uh, we made the payment also we'll check whether everything is correct or not so uh, you have to go to a uh, party table account okay for that you have to go to display in the gate of tally you have to select display uh, here you have to select statement of accounts outstanding tables here you have payables of all the parties okay here you have uh, this uh, ABC company also okay ABC company has uh, two balances okay one is 10,000 that is opening balance and uh, one more is 1,000 okay against 10,000 we have made 9,000 payment if you need detailed view here you will get it the purchase <coughs> you made for 10,000 and the swap item everything is there and a payment made against that 9,000 here you have opening balance okay this is the outstanding cables if you want to uh, see the ledger particular ledger ABC company ledger you can go to ledger uh, same path um, uh, get to have tally display statement of account outstanding ledger okay select abc company will get detail of only abc company so detailed view here you have everything so the final balance of the abc company is 11000 10000 opening balance he has to pay and uh, 1000 of the bill number 123 okay uh, hope uh, everybody got this and uh, if you have any queries you can uh, type on comment box okay uh, if you have not subscribed till now my channel you can subscribe okay kindly support if you have uh, once again if you have any query please comment on the comment box okay thank you for watching be safe